Severe winter weather is on its way across the South Plains, and emergency crews are already out treating our streets. Our Emily Harrison joins us tonight in the studio. Emily, they're urging drivers to be safe. Terry, the Department of Public Safety says they're expecting some accidents to happen tomorrow, and they're hoping people will be mindful of this and stay off the streets if possible. Of course, for first responders, that's not an option. And with all the recent tragedies we've seen, they've made some changes in how they'll approach tomorrow. I've had some close calls on the side of the road where folks have slid by and struck vehicles that I was standing next to. Concerns for both first responders and drivers are leading to big changes on how they go to crashes. There have been nerves since the day that that happened and, and that's, you know, we we have to learn from what happened and we have to get better. But yes, there are definitely nerves. There's already, uh, you know, some planning going in. Lubbock Fire and Police will now block both lanes of incoming traffic and call in additional backup if there's no protection between highways. Are we doing the absolute best we can to keep everybody protected? We think we've made a few of those changes. We'll react as, as necessary. On Monday night, the Loop, Marsha Sharp Freeway, I-27, and more roads across town were pre-treated for the incoming snow. And the Emergency Operations Center will be open at noon on Tuesday. Well, we always try and anticipate it. You know, you always have to uh, prepare for the worst, you know, and a lot of times that's where all the departments can kind of come together and see what red, uh, resources we need to utilize for something like this. They just need your help to make sure everyone is safe this week and to just slow down and move over. The deaths are unacceptable, number one. Yes, I mean, every accident's preventable. You got to pay attention to what you're doing. Your focus needs to be 100% on that driving. Then we start putting not only ourselves in danger, but we put everybody that we, you know, come across that day in danger. Now, TxDOT also warning drivers to be aware of possible road closures and to just please be flexible with them. Terry.